This morning, we are learning more about a new discovery in one of the world's most ancient structures. Scientists say that they have found a mysterious chamber hidden deep inside Egypt's Great Pyramid of Giza. The cavity is the first larger inner structure discovered inside the pyramid since the 19th century. Jonathan Vigliotti is in London's Petrie Museum of Egyptian Archaeology with what researchers think it might be. Jonathan, good morning. Good morning. Egyptian culture has mesmerized researchers like those here at London's Petrie Museum for centuries. Scientists spent two years using new technology to see through the pyramid. It's still unclear what's inside the chamber, but the dream scenario would be finding artifacts like these. New clues into our ancient past. Egypt's Great Pyramid has been shrouded in mystery for hundreds of years. Now, with the help of modern science, a breakthrough discovery. The hidden chamber stretches around 100 feet, about the same size as the Statue of Liberty. It was discovered just above the Grand Gallery, a corridor that leads to the burial chamber of Pharaoh Khufu, for whom the pyramid was built. Only for the moment, talking about a void. Mehdi Tayubi is part of the international team of researchers who made the discovery. At the moment, it's still unclear what exactly this void is. Maybe it could be a second Grand Gallery, uh, or uh, if it's horizontal, a big tunnel. Using a technique called muography, researchers planted special plates inside and around the pyramid that recognize subatomic particles passing through the rock, revealing what is stone and what is empty space. This kind of CAT scan for rock allows them to look deep inside the 4,500-year-old structure without drilling holes. For several years, archaeology and looking at this kind of monument was a kind of uh, destructive approach. And now we demonstrated that we can scan and look behind the stone. Some experts have suggested the pyramid's architects designed the space to help maintain structural integrity. Regardless of its purpose, discoveries like this may help re-energize Egypt's crumbling tourism industry. This is absolutely an important part of the Egyptian economy. 14.7 million tourists visited Egypt in 2010, but the country was hit hard by a 2011 uprising and the bombing of a passenger plane in 2015. Visitors to the country dropped to 5.4 million people last year. There was you know, optimism among Egyptian officials that discoveries like these would, um, would spawn interest. Researchers say currently there are no plans to drill into the cavity, but they are developing a tiny flying robot, which one day might be sent in to explore what's inside. Nora. I want to see that, what's inside. Thank you so much. Jonathan Bigliotti in London. Thank I you. I want to go.